What's up guys, Big D Wiz back once again with another amplifier dyno test. What do we have here today? Man, I bet a lot of you have never heard of this brand, Sonido Mask. This is a manufacturer that contacted me after I tested the um, audio pipe and said, hey, we've got a 1500 watt amp too. This is the ZX 1500.1. Said, uh, yeah, I'd like you to try our amplifier out. I said, okay, send it on over. So they did. So before we get started, I want to give a shout out to my buddy Hugo at 5A Acoustics. Check the description for a link to his website. He builds custom boxes and all kind of real cool stuff. He um, got me a set of these uh, SMD DeMore Engineering RCAs, which come with a real cool uh, guide here that tells you what, they, what, they, uh, what the resistance of them is. This, these are six foot RCAs, super high quality can see the high-end connectors there. DeMore Engineering, super high quality RCA. So no more of the junky dollar store RCAs. We're gonna use the high quality stuff from now on. So the amp has been set using the DD1 uh, plus mode here on the dyno. And we've warmed it up for a little bit. So let's go ahead and do a certified run. And before we do that real quick, let's see. We wanted to pull out the ratings of the amp. What is it rated? According to the manufacturer, at one ohm at less than 1% distortion, 1600 watts. Now it doesn't say the voltage here, but on the box it says 14.4 volts. So we're gonna aim for as close to 14.4 volts as we can get. And that may require me to turn up my um, power supply's voltage, but I can do that because we have adjustable power supply. That's how we roll. All right, so let's go mono. Again, this is the certified track. And we're gonna run it. Here we go. What can she do? 1600 watts, where are you at? Oh, 1330 watts at 14.36 volts not quite there and that voltage is very close to the rating so wow not quite what they said it would do well just for kicks just because you guys will probably want to see it anyway let's see what it does at clipping see if it does that 1600 watts at clipping at one ohm doing track four Here we go. Oh, uh, well there's 1500 watts at 14.09 volts. Uncertified, so that's two clipping. Now since we've already taken the time to do both of these tests, let's go ahead and do the dynamic run. Dynamic run at one ohm mono. just for kicks got set on track one this is a pulse track simulates music there we go now we're climbing up 2026 watts whoa 2121 there we go so it appears this amp has got some good reserve power since we're having so much fun here let's go ahead and try the half ohm I know some of you guys don't really like this dynamic test, but I don't really care because I like it. So just sit back and watch. Boom! 2,748 watts dynamically from a 1,500 watt amp. That's not bad, my friends. So it appears that the, uh, the Sonido Mask is not a big fan of the test tone but we sometimes see that with amps, so that's okay. Dynamic power means it, it's better with speakers, and that's kind of what you want anyway. So unfortunately, the, uh, the ratings are a little bit under what the book says for the continuous tone test, but uh, as far as dynamic power goes, this is a pretty, pretty amazing little 1500 watt amp doing almost 3000 watts. 
So there you have it, just a quick test here. Big D Wiz with the SMD Demore Engineering App Dino. Make sure you guys stay tuned, subscribe to my channel, more tests coming. I will be moving soon, so the tests may come slower for a little while, but that's cool. You guys will hang out with me. You know Big D will come back, show you some good stuff. Until next time, my friends, I'm out of here.